the lay foundations, order materials and book laborer tasks occur in parallel as separate process branches. After each of them completes, the quality review task is run before that branch of the process finishes. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and this video is part of a series on BPMN and workflow patterns. Today we look at the multi-merge pattern. The convergence of two or more branches into a single subsequent branch such that each enablement of an incoming branch results in the thread of control being passed to the subsequent branch. You can see the behavior in the original flash animation. So here the multi-merge. After task E we choose task B, the upper branch, and then we go directly to task D. In the second case, after task A, we choose the lower branch and the multi-merge goes directly to task D. In the next case, at the multi-merge, we choose both branches and the first one is B that finishes and the multi-merge fires twice after C has finished. In the next case, the multi-merge goes to the two tasks B and C, C comes first, D is executed, then there is B and D is executed again. Now we have the multi-choice with B and C and they are finished simultaneously and the multi-merge still fires twice and D is executed twice. Note that this still causes two activations of task D. In BPMN, the multi-merge is easily implemented by a joining exclusive gateway. So here in our BPMN simulation, we have activated the top and the bottom branch and not the middle one for demonstration purposes. And after book laborer has finished, we run the quality review on this and then lay foundation comes next and we run the quality review again. We have inserted an intermediate event after lay foundation simply for demonstration purposes. This way we can see that the run quality review task is executed twice. Although in this example it looks like we want to have one quality review for each task that has been activated by the splitting inclusive gateway, there are some problems with this. The first one is how to know at the quality review which of the tokens has arrived. Which of the results needs to be reviewed. The second one is what happens if the process continues after the quality review. Do we want one instantiation of the rest of the process for each token? Probably not. Anyway, let me know what you think. Did you ever use this pattern? Thank you for watching.